So just when you thought things couldn't get any more ridiculous down in Dalton slash Thornton Township, Illinois, here we have Big Tiff's cooking show, which was just released. And of course, it's just as stupid as we thought it would be. Now, I need y'all to let me know, does your mayor do this in your towns? Wherever you live, please let me know in the comments if your mayor has cooking shows for you all to learn how to make meatloaf. Hi guys, it's me, Supervisor Tiffany A. Here you're the people supervisor. Huh? I will be coming to you once a month along with a special guest resident to show you how to prepare different foods that you can make using the ingredients provided in Thornton Township food boxes. No. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Food boxes are available here at Thornton Township. Huh? Oh, love this. Finally, I am here with Miss Christy, and we are about to make pilaf. No. 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 Hell no. 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 I refuse. No. The show is to showcase residents throughout Thornton Township and show everybody how they cook in their homes. So, Miss Christy, what are we making today? We're making meatloaf. Okay. All right, so I'm going to take over here with the narration because the music is annoying and it gets louder and louder and louder and you can really barely hear them speak. Not that you really need to get direction on how to make meatloaf, but help me understand why it is that anybody needs to take the time to use funds, money, time, energy, effort in order to record a show. Tiffany, you could have done this in the basement instead of Big Bingo. I don't know where this kitchen is. I don't know if y'all know. I'm pretty sure it's not her house. I'm going to assume it's not Miss, whatever her name is, his house. So where's the studio at that you probably had to rent and spend money for that as well? There's nothing amazing about how to make meatloaf. It's just meatloaf. It's not even like they came out here talking about they're going to make some surfing damn turf. Is she so proud of herself? Big Tiff is so proud of herself for this moment that she was able to do this cooking show with a senior, mind you. That's her people. Those are her people. That's who stayed at that last special meeting where she ran off the rails, running off at the mouth to support her. I really want to know what is going on in Thornton Township, Dalton, with regard to your seniors. What is the actual problem? Maybe that's where trustees need to concentrate. Did people just bring their parents and their grandparents, drop them off in Dalton and said, see you, good luck, and left town? Why is it that nobody has any type of family? Why is no one's children helping them? Why are there no other people that can come in and help these people? It's like a vast land of senior citizens that were dropped off in this place called Dalton Thornton Township. And now it's Tiffany Henyard's responsibility to take care of them all. I'm concerned. I'm confused. Who? Where did this influx of elderly persons and people come from? Where did they come from? This lady here, when she was speaking to Big Tiff, she said she'd been a resident for 40 years. Where's her family? Where are her children? Where are her grandchildren? Where are her nieces and nephews? Her husband even? Anybody? Anything? So you're telling me that every single senior citizen has no one and nothing? We listened to them speak. They spoke at the bingo. They spoke on the news. They speak at the meetings. They need her. They need the resources. They need the food. They need the grass. They need the windows. They need the siding. They need the snowplow. Is this where people just take their parents and their grandparents, drop them off, and instead of paying for a facility for them, they have Big Tiff paying for everything? She went on and on and on about ice cream. Ice cream for seniors. It's that bad down here that you have to go and be on national TV in order to say, that the residents are suffering because they didn't get ice cream. Now, we all heard and understand from Trina, shout out to Trina, that Big Tiff can write checks. We all know that Big Tiff was given a credit card with her name on it, and yet she didn't use it to go buy this ice cream that was needed. Why aren't you using your resources, Big Tiff? Because she wants it all. And all is what she's allegedly given these people. And it doesn't matter whether they see it or not. They believe it 
to be true. Help me understand how anyone is going to combat that. Bueller, I really would like someone to, to tell us how they're going to combat that. Do we not? This is not old. This is not old what we're watching right here. She just did this. She just did this. And this woman is here. And I promise you, I promise you, there's enough senior citizens that are going to see this and they want to be next. I'm up next. They probably going to be fighting. You probably got to give something to Tiff in order to get on here. You think that they're not clamoring to be able to do this, to be able to be seen, to be able to be with their savior, um, Tiffany Henyard? The people's mayor, I love you. Your kids don't love you because they dropped you off. Your grandkids don't love you because they dropped you off. Your sons and your daughters, they out there living their best life. They dropped you off. I'm the only one. I love you, and there's nothing you can do about it. You, No matter how negative you are, no matter what it is that you see, it's adversity, and I can get through it, and I'm the one. I, You can depend on me. I'm fighting for you. That's what that meeting was showing. I am fight for you, senior citizens. I fight for you, Meemaws and Peepaws. Even though, do we see any men? Do we ever see any senior citizen men as much as we see senior citizen women? Y'all not going to like what I'm about to say. Y'all not going to like what I'm about to say, but I'm going to say it. Is this where you end up when you out here talking about, I don't want a man, I don't need a man, I don't want a man, I don't need a man, and I can do it all by myself, sis. And you don't want to get married, and you want to be a feminist, and you want to do it on your own, and you can do it, and woman power, and all that. This could be where you end up. Thornton Township, Dalton. I know there's a lot of people that probably have lost their spouses and things. I understand that. I understand that. That one woman who loves Tiff, who we saw at the daggone meeting at the podium, and we saw her on her bingo uh, video, said that she got divorced, and she got this big old house, and she needs somebody to help her. Ma'am, call your ex-husband, child. Call over there and see if he can give you $35 to get daggone grass cut. Kids just don't have to do anything around here. We all know they out there getting H-I-G-H. That's based off what they said. There's the recipes if y'all needed it. One from Tiff and one from Miss Christy. Miss Miss Christy, okay? In case you needed a recipe for daggone meatloaf, Tiffany Henyard is here to help you. And she's helping you because she gives you the boxes that you need with the food in it in order to make these recipes. So she's making these people completely dependent upon her. She is their savior. I'm just trying to understand how anybody is going to combat that, whether they're running for supervisor or they're running for mayor. You've got a lot of work to do, even if you don't think that you do. You got to get them other 17,000 people in Dalton mobilized and however many people it is in Thornton Township. I know everybody thinks that she's not going to get reelected. Okay, fine. We'll be here to watch. That's what they also said about Marin Barry and that dude Trayvon Martin, whatever his name is down D.C., who just got clipped for bribery and they want him back. That's it. That's all. Like this daggone video. Make sure you comment, subscribe. If you are new, i see you all in the next one. Because y'all got false narratives out there and y'all should be ashamed of y'all stuff. Y'all black. Y'all are black. And y'all sitting up here beating and attacking on a black woman. That's in power. You're going to jail. You're, You're going, going to jail. jail. Gato, unass that seat. Unass that seat. Unass that seat. To express my deepest gratitude to Tiffany Henyer and her team for their commendable efforts to better our community. Just come here. <laughs> Shut your stupid ass up. Oh. Come here, say it.